One of the easiest ways to create a video assessment is to have a meeting with yourself in Teams and record it. The meeting video automatically uploads to your stream page where you can share it with your course convener. Then you just need to submit the link to your video through your Learn at Griffith course site. Open the Teams app on your computer and click into your calendar. To meet with just yourself, click on Meet Now. Make sure your camera and microphone are on and click on Join Now. Teams is reminding you that there is no one else here with this People panel. You can just close it. If you are presenting with PowerPoint or sharing something from the web, click on the Share button in your menu bar and select from the options below. If the PowerPoint you want to share is not here, click the Browse button to find it on your computer. If you record with a PowerPoint, the video will still have your thumbnail in it. Once you are ready, click into the three dots in your menu bar and click to record. If your video is face to camera only, remember you can drag a transcript in front of your Teams window which will not appear in the video. Centre your document underneath your webcam and keep the font size large so you can take in more text at a glance without scanning. Also, try to look straight into your web camera as often as you can. When you are done, smile and pause. Then click into your three dots to stop recording and hang up your meeting. A solo meeting will appear in your Teams chat. Click into chat and into that meeting with yourself. Your video may still be processing. Once the thumbnail appears, click into the three dots and select Open in Microsoft Stream. This takes you to your Stream page. If you need to find a previous recording, just click into My Content and Videos for a list. You need to share your video with your course convener or tutor, but before you do that, you may want to trim it first, and this is why I told you to smile and pause at the end. Click into these three dots and select Trim Video. Use the cursor and the play button to make sure your video starts in the right spot, then drag the pink bar to trim the video. Repeat this process for the end of your video, then click Apply. Now click into those three dots once more, and this time select Update Video Details. A video in Stream must be shared to be viewable by others. You may need to share your assessment video with one or more tutors or with a group, so make sure you check your assessment instructions. To share with one or more individuals, just type their name, click to search and select. You can also change the name of your video here. Make sure you hit the pink apply button to save your changes. To grab the link to your video, click on the share button, then copy the URL. Now paste that URL into a Word document and save it somewhere on your computer. It's a good idea to put your name in the title. And finally, upload this document to your Learn at Griffith assessment submission point.